we are pulling in to go to Max Barbecue. This is a brand new building here, and it's on the property that I used to own when I had Smitty's Sports Shop. I want to include a picture of Smitty's Sports Shop, the old one, in this video. 13 acres. here we had a uh, sports shop building we had a house next to it that mom and daddy lived in had a garage next to that that uh, my brother Emery and his wife uh, used to repair cars and paint cars down in the back Emery had moved a mobile home down there and put in a septic tank and water well so that they could live down in, the, in this area and we had a big pond down here, right ahead of us. That obviously gone now. Or no, it's still here, I guess. Kind of hard to see from here. But we used this quite a bit. Tanya?
This is what used to be Sears Roebuck. And the building straight in front of us used to be the Sears Customer Service. It's the stuff in and out of the uh, in and out of there. Mm. You can turn around whenever you're ready. <laughs> this is the Baptist church. Originally, was a Baptist church where my dad built the baptismal, and I was baptized at age 13. Also, I think it's where Cammy and Gary got married, right here in this church. Tammy's first husband, Dustin's dad. Down here on the right is, this is Ellis Street, we're gonna take a left right here. But on the right, that's Orange Square. Now it used to be called Orange Park when we came down here and played. I used to bring my little brother Andrew down here. This is Ellis Street where I used to walk up and down his dirt road and, and uh, pick up bottles to take down to the store to turn in. There's your red bird. Yeah. The next block down is where we lived at 2011 Ellis Street. All this was dirt road back in the day. <coughs> right, go slow down here. C twenty eleven. Twenty fifteen. Twenty eleven, right there. This house right here. Yep. It's twenty eleven Ellis Street, where I was where I lived for a long time. This is 2011 right there on the mailbox. Okay. This house on the corner over here, the blue looking house, is the one that Miss Hollingsworth lived in that, that she would let Wayne and me come down and watch TV in the afternoon. She was the only one on the block at a TV. And over there, this is the corner right here that you see me with my uh, police crossing, crossing guard. guard outfit on. Yeah. Just right here, J Street and Ellis Street. The second house down was the Roses where George Rose and his family lived. Picture this right here. This was a family dollar store and all on is now. It's the site of my school, Purvis School. I went to school in the elementary from grade one through six. And they tore it down. And this is the infamous Twin Oaks Drive-In. When I was a teenager, started driving we would come down here to get french fries and a hamburger. Miss Judy would bring it out to the car for us. We would park out here and order our food. I 
think it was because of you they put these speed bumps up. <laughs> it, could, it could have been. There was a lot of us boys back in those days that would come in here and squeal our tires. A lot of memories here in this old Brunswick town. Well, a lot of new stuff has come up. A lot of new stuff has come up. A lot of the old town, the old things are kind of run down. Now, across the street from Twin Oaks is the AT&T building. And this is where my cousin, Peggy Jewell, at the time, Peggy Duckworth now, yeah, was an operator. Seeing a friend of hers from up in uh, Cedar Cross and Lions, Uvalde area. Go right. See the front, the building. And the side is where this I thought. National we Guard Armory right here is where uh, Eloise's uncle. Virgil ran that place. They used to hold um, uh, well they had uh, people like Jerry Lee Lewis come in there. I saw Jerry Lee Lewis live in concert there. We're turning left on Gordon Street off of 4th Street and down here at 3412 Gordon is where well, the Newburns lived here. Jimmy Newburn's parents and Jimmy when he was young. And on Dan Lewis, I think it's 3412. Should be this one right here. It yep. is. 3412 right there is where my uh, Papa Watts and Mama Ruth Watts lived. Then we'll go down here and take a right off this street. And then the house on the corner of Fifth and Johnson Street is coming up. This house on the corner right here is where we lived, right there, in that house right there, 3501 Johnson. 